Hi everybody, this is Mark from Somnium Guitars, here to introduce the second in our series of videos with award-winning guitarist John Willis. Now John's got two Somnium guitars and of course one of the reasons he wants to be able to switch pickups in them is so he can select the right tone for the right type of music, whether it's individual pickups, sets of pickups like this. So today we're going to find out what types of pickups John uses and what's in his collection of Somnium cartridges. Let's listen. Well, that's that's kind of the reason that we designed these guitars that for the same thing mm -hmm. is that I had not nearly this many guitars, but you find one guitar that, yeah, it sounds really bluesy, sounds really good, but the next kind of chunky, it's not what I like. And then you want to go to a humbucker, they'll get away from the single coils. Now I got to pick up a different guitar. And again, like you said, it might feel that great, but it has the humbuckers. I had to wire in the humbuckers I wanted, but then I lost the sound that was in that one. Mm -hmm. So you're forever unsatisfied with with what you're using and, and yeah. back and It's forth. like you're getting 87% there, but you're not getting 100% there. And you know, really, I'd rather spend more money and get 100% there and be happy mm -hmm. than be 87% there and go... Oh, good enough, because good enough isn't really good enough, especially in this business. Right. Now, how do you find yourself? You, you, I think you mentioned when we first got here that this right here, these two pickups, which this, uh, the next pickup is a DiMarzio mini bucker, mm -hmm. a PG 13, I think. Mm -hmm. And this is a Lawler Chicago steel. Now those, you said those are your main go-to pickups. Well, when I'm not swapping pickups out to do the same sound on the two in the keys yeah and i'm just basically just playing i've found that this combo in this baritone kicks country and western ass mm -hmm. i mean I, i've never had a guitar with this on it i've heard guys with lat steels that had a similar thing and i thought well, wouldn't that be cool to have on a guitar and i've seen a couple of guys on tv that have these Chicago Steels is that what it is? Yeah, it's called? Chicago Steel. For, you know, they play a lot of slide and stuff, but man, to me, it's like the ultimate version of a telly that's fat. It's got like crolicans and it also has some zing on the tops. I got the thorn buckers because I wanted to try that out, and that's my other combination. That's usually what's in the six string because I can coil tap and it gets that uh, the the middle pickup sound. Of course, on these things, you switch to here, and it's like looking yeah. amazing. Uh, I use that a lot. I mean, I use all of these. Maybe these not as much because they're a little... They're really good pickups, but they're kind of polite. They're black. Those You didn't get those from us. I don't know. No. Well, well, that's another thing that I wanted to point out to folks is that John got some cartridges, just empty cartridges, because he had some pickups here here in his studio that he wanted to be able to try out and mix and match so you can easily swap these out with a screwdriver yeah i did it i i may have called y'all maybe yeah because i gotta say it scares me to death to do that i don't lift my hood and check my oil because i never hire a plumber to do a guitar solo <laughs> that's my motto but I called y'all and it was pretty easy. I mean, I shit, I did it. If I could do it, anybody can do it. Yeah, just a screwdriver. There's little screws here and he just split the cartridge open with these four screws and we told him where to put the wire. You know, one wire goes on number one, one goes on number four, whatever it was. And say you got it together for, and that was even for coil splitting, I think. Yeah, but, it does everything. Yeah. I mean, those, those pickups are great. I, I tell you, they're a little polite for me, but I, I feel like it's because I haven't found the right amp mm -hmm. for these guys. I feel like I, uh, and that's just because of time. I mm -hmm. haven't had enough time to mess with them. These guys, the Thornbuckers, basically they usually ride in the other guitar all the time. In the standard scale. Yeah, but uh, I was doing some Strat stuff, so I think it's got the Strats in it. No, I'm not sure what brand these are. Those are, I think those are Fralins. But yeah. they, they're cool. I mean, they're really, they're not too shiny because I, I mean, I got old, I got an old strat over there and I've got a line six strat that actually is really good. These guys fit in a, in between those. So they're not so shiny like a line six and they're not so, I don't want to say dark, but, uh, that, uh, uh 
ah, oh, what's his name? Rory Gallagher guitar. It's very stratty sounding. Mm -hmm. This is a little more, I don't want to say expensive, but I will. It's, this sounds more like you're already there. That one I have to work a bit. This one, this strat pickups on here are, they're already finished sounding. Mm -hmm. And, you know, obviously with the switches, especially like the strat with the two outsides because it's yeah. unusual mm -hmm. yet usable. Yeah. Uh, so that's what's in there now. But I mean, I've really been using that a lot. Well, what you, one thing you just said, because I, I know I have, we have people ask us, well, if I put Strat pickups in it, it's not really going to sound like a Strat because it's got a hole in the middle and it's a, it's a metal cartridge. It's not, it's not going to sound the same. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to call bullshit on that because I've owned probably 20 or 30 Strats. Mm -hmm. They all sounded different. Mm -hmm. You got to find one that you like, that feels good to you. And that sounds the way you want a Strat to sound. And, you know, I've had Strats that, were very, very expensive and ones that were cheap. And it, that to me, the it's, price wasn't the, the no, factor. It, it's the, the feel of the guitar and then the sound. And with the, with your setup, I can experiment. I can try, you know, what is it? You could 20 try. brands of strat pickups yeah. and they all sound different. It's finding the, you know, finding the ones you like. But with this guy, I can put these strat pickups that I love. And then pull it out and put those gold foils on that I love too. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, shit. I hate to say it, guys, but fuck, this works. 